right, and I think uh, we are back. Welcome back, everybody. Welcome back to the channel, and this is the Glitch Pit Anime Edition, or Glitch Anime, Anime Pit, whatever you want to call it. And this is our uh, episode five of Megalo Box, right? Review? Megalo Box. Fuck. Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> Megalobox, Shay, Megalobox. Shay, I, I legit think Shay is going to get that wrong every episode. I'm not. Yeah. No, 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 it's, it's fine. fine. <laughs> <laughs> you know, he must start pronouncing our names wrong too, watch. <laughs> oh, probably. <laughs> All right, but anyway, here we go. So let's let's get right into it. Um, So we finally get to know who this new guy was that, that showed at the last uh, episode at the end. Um, This is Pop's old pupil or disciple, however you want to go. His name is... uh. What is his name? <laughs> no, it's a um, Aragaki. Yeah, his name is Aragaki. We'll go with and, that. And um, <laughs> no, that is his name. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to butcher his name, all right? <laughs> no, it's our it's our Ar- Aragaki. Um, episode is called "The Man from Death" um, for obvious reasons. I really like this episode. It's not too much going on. It's just a lot of backstory on him, and um, the fact that they are um, they're delving into the depths of like ptsd with this guy i think it, it's it just makes him if anything i feel like he can he can be the main character just how interesting his his past is you know yeah i mean i, mean, yes. I mean you can i was just like i just liked how it was interesting they made they, they, they fooled you in the entire episode thinking everything was cool until what's his name pulled up the little video clip and you really saw what happened to the guy during the war shocked the hell out of me. I was like, oh. Yeah, that was messed up. <laughs> well, yeah, oh the God. way it starts out, it's him. He, he goes into a room and it, 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 he thinks it's, I think, I'm guessing he thinks it's a civilian. He flips it over and it's just a whole bunch of bombs. Like, it was just a booby trap body. Like, that was messed up. Like, yeah, and, and the way it starts, like, I had no idea what the hell was going on. And then, you yeah. know, they show his scars and stuff like that. So I was like, oh. And then further on into the episode, you realize he ain't got no legs. <laughs> Where? He yeah, was he fucked fucked up. I was like, "Yo, my man's legs is going. How is he gonna be boxing?" Nah, he's boxing, boxing bro. He got he's like Lieutenant Dan. <laughs> he got megalo legs. Megalo, <laughs> megalo legs. legs. <laughs> yup. <laughs> yup. But uh, but I, I, I I do like where they're going with this in terms of giving Joe his first major adversary before Yuri. Yeah, and this pretty much. This this whole episode was not about Joe at all. It was it wasn't yeah, about Joe. Was, yeah, it was, it was all his, it was about this guy's relationship with uh with pops. Yeah, basically, yeah. um, and what exactly broke their foundation as a relationship? Reason why he stopped uh training with him. Um, th- this episode is great. I mean, like the way they the way they um just go through their backgrounds and the fact that they're they're bringing up a subject that's pretty pretty deep. PTSD is a deep thing to talk about, especially. Now you know in today's world, you know. Yeah. But um, I'm I'm curious to know. Do, do you think he lost? Uh, yo, he he. Yo, word. They was up to nine. I was like, yo, and he once again, Joe, with his little cockiness. He was like, all right, but you know, and pops even told him he's like, dude, I really don't want you to fight this dude. And Joe was like, well, you you promised me that you was gonna help me get to Megalonia, and if he's this guy is ranked seventeen. I'm ranked, what was it? I, I forgot, what is he, like 112 now or something like that? 112, like 107, 112, one of those. I mean, like, if he beats him, you know, that's going to shoot his ass up. So he's like, yo, like, we're, if we're going to get to Megalonia, this is the only way. And Pops is like, yo, you don't understand. Like, don't fight this dude. Like, he's out to fucking hurt you. And the reason why he's out to hurt you is because of me. It's because of him. Yeah, exactly. exactly. And he did, I don't think he told him that. No, I don't think he did, honestly. Another thing that you don't really like, I don't, because this happens in real life a lot, where one thing is something else, um, like a situation happens and there's no real way for you to explain it to somebody. Like how Pops was really upset that he found out that this guy was dead. When you know he really wasn't though. Like no one yeah, knew that. And you know he what's was funny? Alive. And I don't think I, I I don't think Arigaki knew exactly like the way pops reacted to his death because i got exactly felt like, you i see, mean he you, was by himself he had there's no one there was no one around to see his reaction exactly so Aragaki, like yeah his 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 initial thought was like this guy thought i was dead and that was it like he just gave up on me he didn't even try to like you know 
but he really, was really crushed. Like he was yeah. really oh yeah, crushed I mean, about it. he straight he straight through the chair into the TV and like you felt it right there. And I was like, oh damn, where he broke but the then TV. I guess like, after that, he put on that facade that he just didn't care. Like he didn't. I don't know. And the fact that they they the get into yeah, the fact that they get into that he uh, like he was down and out. Like you know, like he he scarred up. He lost both his legs. Um, it got, I, I, I like the part that they even showed to a point where he was considering suicide. Like, he had the gun in yeah, his mouth. Yeah, that was so crazy. That was so crazy. Like, he was ready to... Like, but then it was that ticket that fell out of the boxing gloves, which we don't necessarily know what it really said. It looks like it's I a think dog fight. Like yeah, it looked like they gave, like, a little snippet of it, but... Right. And I, for some strange reason, it seems like that was, like, a... Like, that's what pretty much broke him out of his little... I'm gonna shoot myself moment and maybe the dog fighting wasn't actually dogs but people. It's probably people. It's probably what he was doing before he went Joe. before he went into till he got called into service. That's right. probably what him and uh the pops were doing beforehand. And exactly. that was probably the the last event that they did together to where you know before he got shipped off. And also I like the fact then that got, uh I'm sorry, Kachu, but the the fact that um, Aragaki, like he's he's famous now for, like not only just winning his fights, but like brutally like banging the shit out of these people, like pe beating them down to the point of death. Like his his sole mission is like I I'm going to destroy these guys. Like, yep. He's taking out all his frustration from everything that's happened, specifically on these guys. Exactly. Which is why he's skyrocketed in rank so quickly. Yep. Yeah. But again, I wouldn't necessarily say so quickly because he does have a, a significant record. He's like 30 something wins, a couple of losses, maybe a exactly. draw here or there. Um, this so, is a dark, I mean, like, this is a dark, not exactly dark, but it is kind of dark episode. Dark episode. But uh, it, it's, just so, it's just more complex. It's just showing more complex characters. And if Me uh, Megalobox keeps going this way, it, it's going to be, it's, shut up. It's going to be great. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I know I was really I, I mean, I'm not gonna say I'm disappointed. I was hoping to at least see something between Yuri and the number two guy, but I guess they'll save that for another episode. Most likely, yeah. All right, all right, wait, 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 time out. This is something I want to talk about now because this is gonna be what twelve episodes, thirteen, thirteen, twelve episodes. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I feel like there's gonna be a season two already. Like I, I can just feel oh, it. Oh, I feel like they're not gonna get to that there's point. Definitely, there's definitely gonna be a season two. I honestly think Joe loses this fight and he drops think... back in ranking. Do you think that after this, though, in, like, season two, there's going to be more than 12 episodes a season, especially off the success or whatever? Um, I can see that. Maybe go 24, double it up. Depends seven. on how big. The, remember, we don't know how big the Megalonia is, period. How many yeah, boxers are actually invi and, like, invited exactly. to actually qualify for it. We don't know the depth of the tournament, if it's bracket style, if it's just... Whoever wins, they move up. Type of yeah, we don't know exactly. what they're gonna do. But um, the fact that they left this on a cliffhanger, like you know, they go in there, they're you know, toe to toe, scrapping, scrapping. Pops like, dude, he's like, you know, he's he's coming after you. You better watch it. And then um, Aragaki, he just hits him, just bam, first round knockdown. Like Joe felt like felt that shit. Like I felt that shit. You know. And they yeah, just the ball twisted up. It was worse. Kind of and then they start doing the ten count, and they get all the way up to nine. And they're like, "Oh, that's it. That's the end of the episode." Yeah, and, so I'm and, like, and oh, the damn. There. Yo, I'm man, like, oh, I thought I was like... watching Avengers again. Just saying. Uh, <laughs> word. <laughs> just like, just like, just, just, just damn. And then it cuts to black. Like, yo, what? <laughs> what? Yeah. But it was a really oh, well. good episode. Find out. Yeah. Find out I'm next time in the do. next episode yeah. of Megalobox. <laughs> Oh, oh, right. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but yeah, that's pretty much it. I, 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 uh, I ranked this episode. This is actually a very good episode, honestly. I would say, like, oh, yeah, definitely. I would say if I wanted to rank this episode out of five, just uh, straight five, even though there was like no almost no boxing in it whatsoever until the end, the fact that it just showed a more complex character, and, and this is not look, something tells me we're gonna see more of this guy. Well, I'm I'm overall happy with the way they did it because 
I mean, you have one straight episode where he won three straight fights and two more, and he was in the Megalonia. I'm happy they broke it up to where he fought, he fought someone who he's not going to beat, which should be a reality check for when he actually decides he's ready to fight Yuri. Exactly. So, all right, if he loses this fight, he's going to have to fight someone higher than 17. <clears throat> no, nah, he's going to have to build... Well, maybe, but he's going to have to build... But remember, he, back just, up again. he only has two more fights, and this is that... Which is one of those two? This is one of those two yeah. fights? Yeah, yeah. I think Shay's right. Yep, yep. And I, I think he lost this one. I, I mean, like, I don't know... I'm like they got the match to right, nine so if count. He loses this. Do you think he's gonna drop Gearless Joe? You think he'll drop it? You no. think someone's gonna be like, "Listen, we'll sponsor you and give you gear"? I don't think so. I think they're still gonna go with the Gearless Joe thing. Cause you gotta remember on the cover, he does have gear. It's not like he didn't have gear. It's yeah, not like, you know, it's not like they really want to. I don't really think they want to revolve it around this. Cause he got changed his name three using... times so far. And plus they. They specifically said the gearless Joe was to strike interest and make, make people more interested in. Exactly, who he I was. think this is a gimmick yeah. to try to get sponsors like, to, to get, get in to, get to make people fight him, and that's what happened. Make people fight him, and that's what, exactly. And he got all the way up to seventeen, you know, because it it drew enough interest to where it was noticeable. And he goes exactly. Well, there goes pops right there, and then he's like, "I want to fight him," and how, that's pretty much how this fight happened in the first place. Way to mm -hmm. go, pops! You 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 ruined Joe. How about that? <laughs> <laughs> it's all pops' fault. Pops it's all pops' Star fault. Lord. Pops. Yes. He's, oh, oh, he's Star oh, Lord. Yeah, well, spoilers. Avengers spoilers. <laughs> <laughs> all right, but anyway, that's that's the episode. I I give it a five out of five. It's pretty good. Um, until next week. I mean, like, please like, comment, subscribe. Check us out. Check out a podcast. Um, we're gonna actually start doing more anime soon because it's just so much that oh, we yeah. can review. But um, oh, other than that, you guys though, exactly. Guys. Other than that, we're just gonna be. <laughs> we need to talk about Food Wars, right? Oh, we can it's do that now. forever. <laughs> not now, but it it's coming. Soon. But yeah, yeah that's definitely. pretty much it. And uh, please like, comment, subscribe, and that's it. Till our next video, our next uh, podcast. We out. Deuce. Deuces. Deuces. Later.